All right, thanks, JB. 8 News is taking action tonight, giving you an inside look at what a dozen Chesterfield County students experienced when they were involved in a bus crash in April. What you're about to see is exclusive video obtained by 8 News, and we do want to warn you, this footage may be upsetting to some of our viewers. This is the moment a truck slams into the side of a Chesterfield County school bus. The impact being felt by the driver and students who slide into the left aisle as the bus rolls onto its side. The bus then comes to a halt in a watery ditch, that water flooding into the bus surrounding students who try to get up as Good Samaritans rush over to help them. 8 News reporter Rachel Keller joins us in studio to break down this shocking video. Rachel. Well, Deanna, Eric, back in April, two Chesterfield County employees and five special needs students were hospitalized after their school bus was hit and ran off the road. After filing a records request, we received this video of the accident from Chesterfield County Public Schools without audio. Shocking video obtained by 8 News shows a truck slamming into the side of a Chesterfield bus at 3.49 p.m. on April 21st. The bus driver and students jolting into the air. Chesterfield schools blurring out the children to conceal their identity. The bus landing on the passenger side as muddy water quickly rises inside through the windows, floating backpacks and items loose on the bus. A minute later, the driver puts her hand out of the window, stuck in her seatbelt. The first man, a good Samaritan in a red shirt and jeans, jumping in, heading straight to the back of the bus to help the children. At least five other men jump in afterwards. A man in a tan shirt searches for items in a first aid kit. Nearly 10 minutes after the hit, an officer is seen assisting through the bus driver's window. Kobe Anderson, one of the men jumping into action. We pulled over to the side of the road and we all started just kind of running towards the bus because we didn't know who all was in there. Two adults and five young people between 12 and 17 were inside. Dylan Clayton also took action to help people out of the bus. I ran in there, jumped on the door, a bunch of kids were just in the water. Clayton enters through the back of the bus in a light gray shirt, holding on to a strap. A bird's eye view showing at least one child halfway submerged into the water. One of them was stuck in the water because he was buckled in like fooling but they can keep his head above the water. Chesterfield police says the driver of the truck, 55-year-old Larry Talley Jr., was on Hull Street Road when he veered off the road, overcorrected, and hit the school bus. Video shows everyone exiting through the back. All seven people were taken to the hospital. Authorities say Talley Jr. stayed at the scene. He was later issued a summons for reckless driving and driving with an expired inspection. Now we're told Chesterfield police is investigating. We've reached out again for another update, but you guys shocking video. Yeah, and especially seeing some of those students, although they were blurred, just really submerged in that water and that the Good Samaritans were the only thing keeping their heads above water. Absolutely. And just thinking about what was going through their minds right. during yeah. that incident. Ugh, just Hard to even imagine. Yeah. Right. Upsetting. All right, Rachel, thank you very much for that. And of course, you can find more about this story by visiting our website, WRIC.com.